Good morning. Today is Wednesday the 18th. So we will get our trivia question out and I will see you at the office. Good morning. I am in the office now and so as you can tell. And so first things first, let me get to the answer from yesterday's um, trivia question. What thing ballet premiered in St. Petersburg, Russia? Yes very easy the nutcracker and let me get to today's question before I tell you what's going on today in 1981 Bob and Doug McKenzie released their own version of a classic Christmas song which song is that in 1981 Bob and Doug McKenzie released their own version of a classic Christmas song. What song is that? No Googling, just go for it down in the comments. So what today is going to look like is I need to go to Joanne Fabrics because if you saw my video last night, the um, retreat bag that I cut out, um, the zipper didn't quite match. And initially I was just gonna go with that zipper, but I'm not, I don't like it, yeah, no, that's not gonna work. So I'm go, gonna go to Joanne Fabrics today over lunch. Plus, I need to pick up, I have several notions I need to pick up. Uh, one for this uh, bag, for this coat, and I'm sorry, for this coat, this Vogue coat. Actually, let me take the post-it notes off of here. You guys know I have all my stuff for this coat except for the notions and so I'm not going to do snaps it called for snaps I'm not gonna do snaps I'm just gonna do buttons and so I wrote down the notions I need for this and then there was a couple notions I need still for the raincoat so I'm, I'm gonna get this there it's just notions I'll take you with me inside because this is a different Joann's <laughs> than the ones near my house um, that's closer to me so it'll be interesting. I've been to it several times over lunch, but um, sometime I, I wander down some of the other aisles because they might have a few different things. You just never know. Plus, I am so, ever since I saw Tamika's haul, Crumpets Tea and Sewing here on YouTube, um, she did a pattern haul of some new simplicity patterns. And ever since she showed this pattern, I put pop it up here, I, I, I just want it. I want that pattern and in particular and I'll slide over a little bit it's view D that I want I want to make that so bad and so um, anyway so I if patterns aren't on sale obviously I'm not getting it I don't know if patterns are on sale at Hobby Lobby there is a Hobby Lobby like down the street from Joann's if I have enough time over lunch if they're not on sale at um, Joann's I might pop into Hobby Lobby um, and so yeah we shall see but I just need a couple things what am I wearing today have on a sweater oh it is so cold outside um, but anyway today I am wearing and I put I use the sleeve extension um, this is uh, cashmere up up 10 dress which I will do a sew along for but this sew along probably won't go up until January because I am still just not sure what fabric I want to use so but anyway so let me see if I can back up so this is the Upton has pockets and this is one I've already made all the adjustments on this but I'll probably when I do the um, so long I'll redo the adjustments because I think there's a couple measurements um, that I need to retake and so yeah I'll show all of that because I did um, all the adjustments on this dress and I'll link to that video um, as well um, so you can go back and look at that but then I'll go over it again some of those adjustments in my Upton on video so that is it so i'm gonna take you along with me later this afternoon and yeah we will see you later oh i wanted to also say i remember today my co-workers gift for those who did not see my um 
my uh, video the other day, you know I purchased this Gilmore Girls um, whistlet. And so I am going to give that to her today because I forgot it yesterday, but she wasn't in the office yesterday. So I'm going to give that to her today. And I purchased this from Mormino. I had linked this two videos, two days ago. So go back and check that out. But um, so yeah, I'm so excited about giving this to her today. I'll let you know later what her re uh, reaction was. All right, this is the weirdest angle. I am in the car. I just got out of Joanne's. Okay, I could not record in there. First of all, I couldn't find everything because I had to go through different aisles and no need to make you all <clears throat> dizzy. But I did pick up some things. I didn't care for, I usually only get, like if I need interfacing or something from this particular Joanne's um, because I don't think their selection, you know how different stores have different things. And so their selection wasn't all that great. And I thought they would have this sequin fabric that I just saw in the, <clears throat> the superstore that's not far, that's a little closer to me. Anyway, I'll show you what I got. I did pick up some buttons. These are buttons for my raincoat. I needed 20. And so these were 99 cent each. Um, and then I got, I used my coupon. She did three different transactions for me. I needed twill tape for the Vogue coat. Um, and then for the Vogue coat, I also needed, cause I'm using that denim. And so I got some, these some nice thick, um, almost have a look of, of denim. I don't know if it'll zoom in on this. yeah i like these they're thick too and i needed six so i got six buttons for that and then i picked up this eyelet kit because the raincoat calls for eyelets i'm sure it's to run, run the string the cord through and i did grab porting but and i bought toggles i'm probably gonna go on amazon i got these just in case and i got them for less than half off or something like that um so I'll keep them, but I'm also gonna, cause these don't match. And the placement in the coat, you won't be able to really tell anyway, but I know, and I did find cording, cause I did need cording for the raincoat. But you guys, that line was long and you have to pull numbers in Joanne Fabrics, right? And so um, I pulled the number and I saw on the, on the little screen, TV screen, it said number 66. I pulled my number 69. How come, I don't know, they mess up numbers sometimes, but how come the lady was only on number 63 or 62 and the people ahead of me had baskets of stuff? No, ma'am, I do not have time for that. I need to get back to work. So <laughs> I am getting, I'm actually gonna run down to Hobby Lobby because I have to pass Hobby Lobby. I try to, and that's the other thing about Joanne's, not just this location, but other ones, for whatever reason, I can never get onto the internet inside Joanne's. I don't know what it is. Even the app um, is hard to pull up, pull up and I always have to um, turn off my Wi-Fi. And so um, I'm just gonna, cause I was gonna see if Hobby Lobby ad had um, had up that they had their simplicity patterns on sale. And so um, before I just go, but since I have to pass it anyway, I'm just gonna stop in. I will um, take you with me if there's any luck. Um, okay, I am just getting back to my office. I am uh, late actually getting back to my office because traffic was a beast. Hobby Lobby, they didn't even have, they had the book for the new Simplicity um, <clears throat> patterns, but they didn't have any of the patterns there, nor did they have the drawers, because the number is 9045. They didn't have anything above, it was still in the 8,000. So I am going to go back to the, um, the superstore that's near my house because I actually get off work early tomorrow. Woo, woo. Actually, I get off early tomorrow and Friday, um, but Friday is market. But because um, we're having a department lunch, exchange our gifts and everything, then we get to leave for the day. Um, so I'm looking forward to that. But um, let me show you what I did get from Hobby Lobby. Look at that. 
that is vinyl it is an animal print vinyl and um, it's 28 inches wide and 21 inches in length and I only paid three dollars and 14 cents for this and trust and believe I was going to buy some um, this um, not this particular one but I was looking for an animal print this design um, on Etsy and um, different websites and my punk broidery and different stuff like that because at first I was going to get the cork because um, it's cork and notch or cork and cloth I put the right name on the screen has it in a um, cork actually <clears throat> but now that I found it in the vinyl I may still get it in because I don't need a lot so I'm thinking I may just stick with this but who couldn't pick this up so I just picked it up I may or might may not use it for the project I have in mind which is something for my birthday um, which is in February uh, but yeah but I am so hung up on getting this pattern and this fabric I have in mind I want to use for this pattern that's in my head so I'll just have to keep my eye out for sales for the simplicity patterns um, and y'all know I haven't been buying a lot of patterns this year because I want to work with my blocks but I just fell in love with that top um, but then the fabric I'm going back to that one um, probably tomorrow after I get off work and get a couple yards and I'll show you what that is tomorrow but that's it I think I'm going to wrap it up for the day um, because by, when I get home I'm going to need to get straight to sewing I have quite a few things for business I need well not a few a couple things I need to sew for business because I sold some things and I want to take some things to market but um, I want to be able to sew up these other couple things and so I just want to just sew and not worry about putting up my camera and all this other different stuff and editing so that will be it for me from for today and yeah I will see you in the morning I'm so happy tomorrow next two days are short and then Monday may or may not be a full day then I'm off I'm out of the office until January 6th anyway all right we will see you on tomorrow